Hey everybody, it's Ryan. I am standing here with Austin from Sloan Implement and he set us up with an RTK system today. Now, we just got done mounting it on the 82 and um, Austin, could you tell us a little bit about like RTK? Yep, uh, RTK is a one inch accuracy. Um, yep. So it's gonna be repeatable year to year. We have a base station uh, about eight miles from here. Um, so year to year, we'll be able to map out your waterways and things like that. Um, for your planner, you go right through them and then for this, it'd be one inch repeatable side by side accuracy. So. Um, if you set this at 42 and a half feet, every 42 and a half feet, it's going to make a pass. Yeah, and the reason I specifically wanted just to try out an RTK system for the 82 right now is because we are applying in hydrus, and having sub-inch accuracy can be pretty important when you do um, over a lot of acres. It's it can really save you a lot of money. So I just wanted to try it out. This 82 does have auto steer in it, um, however, it hasn't been activated. But the display that Austin brought does have the activation so we're going to be trying that out and um, the 82 will be able to drive itself and make sure that it's well doing the least amount of passes that it can so um we're going to get started and uh see how much we like it we've been weirding away from if you can't get in the fall don't even do it don't even, really don't even bother doing it in the spring we've had bad luck with it really it's been we've had a lot of we've been burned on it and literally burned it'll burn okay. more. um our black soil isn't as forgiving in Illinois as it can be up here. So uh, I always heard that you have, or you should try to apply it in the spring because you might have. See, we do, some we runaway. come back with a side dress, then okay. um, probably six to seven weeks after, you know, it'll get up, okay. get it about know, ankle high, and then we come back and we'll side, we'll start side dressing. Then by then it's probably you know by the time we get done it's knee high, but mm -hmm. at least get that, and then we'll come back in with a, a cover of urea probably. I don't know, right before tassels, yeah. right at tassel. So, and then we've had pretty good luck with doing it that way. Hmm. You guys hire your application, or do you no, do, do everything? Yourself? We got okay. two bars run. We got a 9560 RT two track, and then a 9220 four wheel drive. We apply with and okay. get it done. That that way we can get it done in the fall. Yeah. You know, so we get two bars. Covering 3,500 acres isn't that easy. Mm -hmm. A 19 shank, you know, it doesn't go that fast. Yeah. What I'll probably do is leave it on adaptive curve so when you do That's one pass, the next pass is. So yep. we'll put it on adaptive curve. I'm going to change this adaptive curve to What's the documentation? So when you drop it down, it's going to start recording an auto track line all yep. the time. So um, instead of when you, so you don't have to click the finger all the time, it'll let you um, uh, do it when it drops down. So as soon as it starts taping the mark and blue out, it will make a line for you. Okay. And then the other thing is just make sure you got this auto steer button on, so it's a steer on, and then this button you kick on your auto steer when you get going. They won't do it now. Oh, it's so it's just like the wind drawer. Yep, same exact setup. Yep. Detent it or detent it, click it in, okay, and it'll start. Should start recording. I think you gotta be moving. There it goes. See it kicked oh. in and started recording now, okay. So, as soon as it does that, then it'll start snapping an auto track line, and there'll be dark blue behind this and a baby white, a dark, darker blue line right behind it. And okay. you know that it's auto track, and when you're done, click it up, it'll kick off the recording just like it did before, okay. Mounted us the 2630 GS3 display, I believe. Correct, yep. And um, right now, you can tell it's running. So, what are we going to do when we sweat, uh, move around? Is everything just going to be automatically set up? Or? Yep. So, as soon as we turn around, it's going to create a line right beside you, and then okay. uh, he'll turn on his auto steer and ready to go. He'll have to just let go of the wheel and take over. Wham, bam, thank you, ma'am. So, now it's running auto steer. Green bar at the top says between zero and one. 